Hello? Hello. We're live! For fucking reasons. Live from Northwich. Beep, 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 beep. Beep, 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 beep. We've uh, we've done some engine checks, we've put some beers and some wines and a new cool box on the boat. Um, we are ready to be pissed this time next week. This time next week we've been voting volume 9 goes off proper. Uh, more videos. We've got three four, in fact, four new videos voting related to come before volume 9 even drops. A uh, lot of stuff going on as far as voting concerns. Uh, just got a new PC so hopefully that will help with getting them all fucking sorted and out there for you guys. Yeah. Fucking fuck you. Ooh, it's Kev in it. It's gotta be Kev. <laughs> fuck you Kev. Son of a bitch. <laughs> we exist. We're testing out the live thing. We're going to probably do a couple of these, because he reckons it's his idea. As we go along our trip, and it'll be a bit of fun. That's you, that is. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so that's, that's us testing the live features. Me? This is getting know. fucking frightening. Is it, is it on mirror mode? That can't be right. No, surely not. I don't know. Look, we're both epic gay but or handsome people. Yes. I think we'll take from this handsome gay. Yeah. Anyway. Handsome gay! <laughs> say, 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 say! Yeah, it's Kev. Yeah, it's Kev. <laughs> <laughs> well, this was a good test. Fuck you guys. Bye. Hello, the internet. We're on a boat. We are on a boat. Way. Look. Way. Stereo. Fucking stereo. Mash up. Crazy Doing monkey well. up in this. Yeah, man. Right. Boys, had enough. Hello, the internet. Cracking on quite nicely. We just cleared Middlewich, the big lock for the three in Middlewich, and then up through Kings Lock, where we stopped to get tasty treats. We're now approaching another lock, which is over there. Put your we lads. The sun's oh, come out. Lovely Sun's come out. Day. We're in our t-shirts now. No hoodies needed. Fucking perfect. <laughs> We're having good times. We're having good times. Yeah. Boy, <laughs> 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 definitely wasn't about to have a piss then. It's alright mate, there's no one behind us. Piss away. Won't film you live on Facebook at all. Lock 68. Crusty slowly but surely approaching this bridge. Carry on setting up for these guys that are behind us because we're quality guys. I can't remember where the next lock is. I've not looked at the map for a long time to be fair. I think it might actually just be over there. We'll have to skim across the as he comes through. But hey, we be boating. It's nice and warm. Me and Krusty got our t-shirts off. Foy would never dream of doing something. Because Foy, down there, pissing. Silly Foy. Um, yeah. We are boating. And it is nice. It is sunny, it is lovely. Superb. Just a little tip. If you're out boating and your boat looks like this, you're doing it fucking wrong. Oh dear. Oh dear. Right, hello again. Um, cretins. Yes, cretins. We're in a, a lock system right now that has dual locks. And yet we've been sat here, literally I've been sat in this, waiting to go up, which thankfully now we are, for a fucking age, like 15 minutes we've sat in here. Because these fucking knobheads ahead of us don't even realise they can use both locks. But also, apparently, the water levels are a bit shit. Bitches 
I don't know. Limp biscuit time though, so that's something. I'm gonna give it a second before I pull out. Gates open, Frosty's moving ahead. So I'm still gonna sit here pretty just in case there's more fucking bullshit to come. You know what it is? It's boating, standard. Stood here waiting. I just saw there was Barry down, which we have taken to mean that there is someone coming through. We were told to wait, so that must be the reason. So we're just chilling, waiting, relaxing, calming down. I think today might be a good day. I think you'll to be have a um, in in this bloody glorious weather. Look at all this shit. Look at that blue skies, toasty warm as well. I'm thinking that maybe we should get that bottle of gin beer in the fridge treat ourselves to a rum and ginger beer. That sounds like a fun idea I think that that would be jolly good. I'm going to go and put ginger beer in the fridge and then hopefully with the length of this tongue, which is really long, we'll, uh, we'll be able to drink some of that when we get out again. Mmm! Right, let's go inside the boat. You can see inside the boat briefly. Here we are. It's voice chaos. Stereo. Ugh. Did not bother making. It smells of fucking marijuana. You don't smoke that crazy shit. Yeah, didn't bother making much yesterday. Stayed up too late. Did too much boating. Too pissed. Good barbecue though. Um, right, ginger beer. That's that one. Is it? No, it's that one. Ginger beer from Mozzers. Into the fridge. <sighs> this is a fucking black pudding. Yes! Oh god! So we're gonna cut that as well shortly. The whole thing! Roast black pudding. Short to go on treat me. Oh you son of a bastard. Fuck it, I'll deal with that in a minute. The rest of the boat, the dumping zone, beer land, also mini recording studio. I've been in touch that much this evening, uh, well, today in general. My lighting's terrible, there we go. Um, we've ploughed through stone. We're in the process of ploughing through stone. We'd be doing it a lot faster though, if it weren't for the fact that we carry on encountering cretins in locks. Like, it seems like almost every single lock we encountered, cretins abound. Right now, as I was slowly cruising up to this one, there was a dude moored up, like right by the lock, and I'm thinking to myself, you utter belly, this is not where you stop for the night. So we pull over on the other side, here, 
Krusty and Foy jump off, go sort the lock out. At which point, mate, matey boy is like, going to jump up and be like, Oh, this is fucking up. Alright, so you what? You were just more there waiting for someone to fuck help you through, were you? You fucking dipshit. Also, we've encountered a lot of negative faces today. A lot of people like them. Seriously, we've gone past a lot of people today that just, like, seen us go by and gone... Fuck you! We're the next generation of boaters. In fact, not even that at this point. I've got kids that have gone boating. They're the next generation. We're the current generation. Fucking deal with it, you stupid bastards. It's just really fucking annoying. I mean, look. Can you see? Frosty and Foy there working these boys. Sorry, this bloke through on his. Frustrated. Obviously, we at this point we have long gone past where we were supposed to be stopping tonight, but it's still early yet. So we're going to work our way through the next this lock, and then there's about a mile or something. There's another lock, and then we're going to call it a day. Still well within daylight, and we're well ahead of schedule. So that's nice. Uh, we'd be boating, everybody. Make sure to check out Volume Nine when it drops. Probably be about <laughs> six to twelve months. <laughs> six to twelve months from now but yeah check out we'd be boating volume nine because then you'll find out a lot more about how fucking annoying today is that oh, was fun. in a bit oh look we'd be boating says yo it's probably kev hi kev bye kev howdy doody face fuckers um it has been a few days since we last checked in multiple reasons for that there's been a lot of low reception i did try to do one uh, a couple of days ago but it's happened none of it Anyway, we're, uh, if you look, we are, come on, flip around you fucker, there we go, we are back at Middlewich, that scene there on that bridge, that glorious sheep incident that you probably should know about by now, tons of fog, probably coming up, somewhere in the distance, uh, still queuing, which you don't know about, but we've been queuing about uh, behind locks behind boats at locks rather for quite some time now today all day the weather is kind of hit and miss I did start the day in a lovely t-shirt and shorts combo which became a topless and shorts combo same for cross the thing which was nice before he nearly got his arms out <laughs> uh, but yeah we are here at Middlewich trying to come back on unfortunately there's no real room Queue. You see? So Crusty's just sort of gonna hang around under the bridge, which is a bit shit. But it is what it is. And then once we get through this lock over yonder, we're uh, we're officially done with the ring. This is the last lock of the ring, and we just head back to Winchester, call it for the trip, which is nice and also shit. But we've had a good time. We've encountered many knobheads though. Things you don't know about, such as one night where we stopped and someone shouted across, if you wake me up one more time, I will burn your fucking boat down. That was fun. Um, then there was a time at 10 to midnight, crashed directly into the front of us. We're mulled up for the night, obviously. I woke me up, I did. Jump out the front, or like, what the fuck are you doing? Not even got his headlight on. Got a shitty light. He's shining around by hand. What a dick. Unfortunately, too dark to get down the name of the boat or its license number so we could make a fucking formal complaint. Um, well, that's frustrating anyway. And last night we ran engine outside the pub until about half 10, 11, something like that. Nothing brutal considering the pub's open and, you know, people out there making noise. Turn off the engine, someone sarcastically yells, Way! Dickheads. We've encountered many knobs, but nah. We're here anyway in Middlewich and that will do for now. We'll try and check in again, I guess, before the trip ends. We've had a lovely time with us, anyway. We'll be both in Volume 9 for the next couple of months. We'll be more. Well, we've been at this top lock for quite a while due to cretins. Excuse me a minute. There we go. Crusty. Now powering us around this corner. Notoriously difficult, but he's done it like a boss. 
Yeah, we've been at that top lock for uh, quite some time now. Due to waiting for someone to come up. And apparently they were doing that Austin Powers manoeuvre to get around the corner. That one. Which, yes, it is a difficult corner, I grant you. But to be there for, like, legitimately 15 fuck minutes is a joke. Plus, we had the guys ahead of us. I don't begrudge them at all. Lovely guys. Apparently, it's been the same crew of them for nearly 20 years taking hire boats away. And we were discussing how we have the same problem when we hire boats because of uh, people looking at hire boat and going, ah, oh, well, they're clearly clueless. Not so. Some of us, what we're fucking doing. Like me, 31 years on the water. Crusty, 20 years. Foy, five ish, I reckon. Point is, we know what we're doing. And now, finally, we're in this one. One more there, then a little cruise around, and then we're at Big Lock again. The last lock of the trip. Brilliant. Take a run at it. Oh, fuck's sake, Kevin. Having a poo. Unbelievable. <laughs> 